Hi. I'm Jefferson. I'm from Brazil. Um, hello, my name is Hannah Kim and I'm from South Korea. My name is Calvin Yu and I'm from Hong Kong. Hello, my name is David. I'm from Spain. Hi, my name is Marina. I'm from Russia, St. Petersburg. Hi, my name is Mohammed from Egypt. Hi folks, um, I'm Fritz, I'm from Germany. Hi, I'm Zoe and I'm from Hong Kong. We're We're excited excited to to New Zealand. Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! It's Stony Brook because it is in New York. The major pull factor was that we were so close to New York. I mean, that's the city, a big app. It's close from New York. It's near from New York City, Manhattan. Um, I chose it because I love New York City. And yeah, it's close to New York City. <laughs> it's the closest I'm gonna get. It was a good option to come here. Uh, well, actually, it was the only one option I could choose from because uh, it was my dream from my early childhood to go to the United States. Because uh, it was close to New York. <laughs> That's wow. about it. <laughs> close to the city. I mean, close to New York City. <laughs> my hobby? Piano. I cannot remember the exact age, but I guess I'm starting piano like seven years old. And I started playing piano just my mom went. I think I love piano much more after I came here. Uh, I love reading, watching movies. Shows. I'm a dancer. I used to play piano for five or six years. I used to play tennis. Um, I'm going to the gym. I'm running like. I have a lot of hobbies. I'm trying to try everything. Uh, uh, I like to dance. I've been to belly dance club, but then there was me. <laughs> <Have you? laughs> Traveling, uh, reading, swimming, and music, of course. I started learning piano at the age of eight. In high school, my interest in music started to increase at that time. In my high school education, I spent most of the time classical music training, like I learned cello and I attained the uh, rates in the VRS occasion. I felt like, well, the classical music kind of, I would, just, I would not say limit my ability, but I found it kind of small to stick with only a genre, like the classical music, and I want to expand it more. So I started to involve in the music production, uh, keyboards and all the recording stuff and yeah I tried to record music and I found a lot of fun inside music production. We play board games every now and then a lot and we travel. Um, I totally forgot about mentioning the travels. We are all pretty broke by now I guess money is just running through our fingers and by the time I leave the US I'll be indebted to my parents. I don't even want to think about the amount that I'm gonna owe them but it's totally worth it. You can't just stay on campus all the time, you need to explore that country and all the rich cultural diversity that goes with it and that's what we're trying to do. I love painting. That's my hobby and only. <laughs> uh, I, I have a lot of... I like playing music. Piano, guitar, drums. I have two hobbies. Basically, I practice karate and then I also love magic. Here it's pretty hard to practice my sport, so we usually take advantage of all these facilities and we play most of the time badminton and sometimes soccer. I'm enjoying every single minute I'm spending here. For me, Stony Brook is education, but it's also people. We are here all living together and sharing different cultures. For me, it's I've met a lot of people from all over the globe. Uh, I got the chance to learn a lot of things about the American society. Um, it's not that different. Really? I, get, I feel like it's similar in terms of like, you know, landscape. It's really big here. It's just people are just different. Yeah, I feel people are nicer. 
No and, way. And nicer here than no, that. No, no, no. That's so true. So I, true. I don't know. People here are so different. Yeah. It's totally different. Everything is so different. People, food, even buildings, everything. Like uh, I feel that this is this is the second reality for me um, because this place, like it happens only once in your life to have an experience like this. United States people are more open-minded. And it's awesome because this way you can really like inhale and soak up the spirit of the American college culture. I really love the sky, the sunset, the space, I would say. We don't have much space in Hong Kong, but here is so many space, that's what I love. I will never forget this time, these people, and the experience I have here. Friendly. Big. Sucker. Diverse. I say new because I have new experience friends. I would say unforgettable. I would say odd. 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 <laughs> Interesting. Sea wolves. Sea wolves. Sea wolves. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye, Bye. 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 See, come to New Zealand. <laughs> but uh, I finished coming here with all my luggage, tired of 20 hours of traveling, 2024. And I came here and there was no one in the residence. I left my luggage inside the room. I got my towel. And I went to shower. Uh, <laughs> and after showering, I couldn't enter the room again, so I was alone with a towel and anything else. So here, my bro, my bro Jefferson, uh, was the only one in the in the in the suite. So he came out and he started laughing at me, <laughs> but he he really he really helped me in that moment. So he went to get the array, and that was a funny story. <laughs>